guys, it's Firefly Kiri, and we are back today to have another episode of our Power Lock. Now, in the last episode, we made it here to almost Lakeport City, and wasn't there a ch cutscene that was supposed to be triggered right here? There was supposed to be a cutscene, right? Um. Maybe I have to go in here first. It's been so long since I played Oris. That I forget where to go. So. We're just going to run around aimlessly. I really wish we had our bike. Ah, that's right. We got to go down this route. Oh, crap. All right. Hmm. This is technically a new route. We could get a new Pokemon. Let's wait. So we definitely can't go that way. Uh. Are you kidding me? What was I supposed to do now? Can't go that way. Can't go this way. Can't go any way. Are we supposed to go on into the... Are we supposed to go on in here? I, I, I honestly do not know. Hmm. I mean, I did not trigger the cutscene. And we're in Slateport City. So, where's the guy that I'm supposed to get this crap to? Is he in here? Hey, there we go. Hi! Hmm? You? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm Doc. Captain Stern commissioned me to drop a few designs for a fairy. Oh, those parts! Those are the diving parts. Hmm, this won't do. Alright, now we gotta go to the museum. Oh. <sighs> well, that was a good three minutes. Sorry. To the museum. Well, there goes some more of our money. Are you all hitting me? I think. Hi. Oh. And here comes the grunts. Haha, <laughs> just a moment. We'll be taking those parts. What? Who are you people? Team Magma. Our boss has needed these parts in that case. So relinquish it to us at once. I don't think so. We're just going to go ahead and take care of you right now. A new mall. 
please. Oh wait. Okay. Come on back, Jason. This looks like a job for Billy. Oh, your focus energy. How cute. How about you catch this water gun? Bye. There's one down. Yep. <sighs> Sorry, I was getting a drink. My throat is a little dry. Here comes another grunt. Oh, you have two Pokemon. And you have a Zubit. Hi, Zubit. It's a Zubit. Yeah, I grinded uh, Jason up a little bit and he learned Flame Wheel. Huh, we avoid the attack. Catch this Flame Wheel. Boom. Bye, Zubit. Yeah. You ain't gonna mess with us, Numa. Let's stay in. And let's see how much this is going to do. Three hit KO. I just want, I really want Jason to get on par with everybody else. Tackle. Ow. That hurt. Flame wheel. Yee. Alright. And Jason's gonna get all the experience for that. Could it be? Yeah! You just got your butt whooped by a little girl. Uh oh. It's Maxi! Now, here I was wondering how you could be held up in the simple act of seizing a case. Do I take it you are being summited by this child? Hmm. Though you are a child, your eyes tell me you of your fierce determination. My heart is pounding in my chest. Yes, I think I can see why my lowly grunts could not stand one man against you. I'm called Maxie. I stand as the head of Team Magma, a noble organization whose goal is to propel humanity to ever greater heights of progress and evolution. Indeed, and you are one of the young persons who may shape our society's future. Considering the fact, I believe I shall educate you in the ways of the world, the land, is the stage upon which humanity stands. The land exists so we humans might continue onward and upward, stepping into the future. For us to continue growing and evolving, humans require a grand stage upon which to stand. A land we, upon which we can stride forward. A land we can explore, develop, exploit. This is the basis for the growth of all human endeavor. That is why we, Team Magma, must increase the landmass of this world. Believe that this will lead to a future eternal happiness for humanity and consequence for all life. <laughs> I suppose the concept may still be too difficult for a child to comprehend. Is that the case? At least I have tried to open your mind. I will take my leave for now. I suggest you take care of that you never again stand against Team Magma. I will not be so lenient next time. I implore you to remember that. We are done here. He's wordy. Akiri, is it? Alright. Yep, here you go. 
All right. All right. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. Uh, what are you doing here? Me? That's a thief. No thanks. Not right now. Alright. Oh, no. Come on. Alright. <laughs> run, 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 run. You. Talk to me. Alright, I'm gonna go upstairs. I wanna see who's up here. Trash cans empty. Yo, people be on point with uh, taking the trash out. There is never anything in them. The end, like the first gen, you would find great balls and things like that. Nope. Not anymore. They clean their trash cans out. And they don't throw away useful items. Not anymore, they don't. Okay. Let's see. Well, now that we've delivered the parts, we can. I think we could go. Oh. Yeah, here's the contest thing. Ah, hi, everybody! Lizza here, and me and my Alteria Ali have come to Slateport City's Contest Spectacular Hall for a bit of fun. Ah, Alteria. Well then, watch me as I divide right into, right in again today. Yeah! Dazzling, dizzy, delirious, defying. Ah! Liz's Miraculous Contest Scouting! Oh my god, the, the thirst! The thirst for people. Any mini miny. <gasps> you there, watching me with that baffled expression on your face. Hi! Have you never joined in a contest? That's just what I want to hear. Then let's get this show on the road. This trainer... I'm going to scout today, and her name is Akiri. Well, I took a good look, and I could easily see Akiri is a powerful trainer with several batches of her own already. Akiri, you can enjoy the contest spectacular at the Pokemon contest hall right here. Now listen up, because I don't just want to see you making your Pokemon strong. I want to see you bring a whole new brilliant side to show them off. Here you go. Take these. Alright. And we got the contest pass. And the Poke Kit. Pokeball Kit. A Carrie story begins today. Yep, and this chapter should be titled A Sudden Encounter Miraculous Contest Scouting. That's what I'd call it. Now everybody out there watching, 
You better expect great things from Carrie, because I do. That's it for today, Lisa's my Miraculous Contest Scouting. See you all next time. Oh, my God. That was painful for me to do. All right. Oh, that was painful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, what I think we are going to do, let's take a look at our Pokemon. Cute, cute, tough, tough, cute, cute. Uh, you know what? For the heck of it, we're going to do this contest and we're going to enter Scraggy. Oh, Akiri. Okay. I, I don't feel like doing her voice again because uh, I really don't. Do I have to come with you? Really? I don't want to come with you. Uh, yes, we're, we're going to try to take on... <laughs> I'm kind of skipping this part because I want to get to the contest. Oh, yeah, yeah. I forgot we had to have a costume. Ugh. I don't like May's costume. Uh. I really don't like May's costume. Can I go now? Thank you. Let me just get a contest done. Yes, please. Hi. Yes, I know how it, how it goes. I know, I know, I know. Yes, I know. Enter. It was tough, right? Yeah. Normal. All right. All right. Let's go. Oh my, oh my, oh my. Oh my, Maku Hita. C dot. Poochin. Poochiana. <laughs> and Scraggy. Zach, let's go. Show him what you got. What happened to our special effects? Y'all saw that, right? She's head butt. All right.
Fire Fang. Catch his head, butt. Hey, we got five hearts. I guess we'll have to go for low kick. How did that get us a star? Dang. Oh my god. I feel like we're going to lose this. Yeah, because he's going to get the star. And now he gets to show off. Yo, that, why was that so powerful, though? See dot. Boop. Uh, let's go ahead, but. Focus energy. Time for a head butt. Oh my, bide. Glad we're not facing it. All right. We're going first again, aren't we? How does that get a star? I I mean, it makes no sense. Literally makes no sense. And now, whatever. We all know that we're going to lose. Um, and the video is getting kind of long. So, I'm going to go ahead and cut it off here. So, remember guys, be good, stay safe, but always have fun. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Oh, here we go. Bye.